Do you have a drone that you've been flying for a little while and you're taking some amazing pictures, but you think that there's just something more that you should be able to do with this drone? You're not quite sure exactly what the next step is. Or are you already thinking that through your organisation, you need to start mapping parts of the environment. Perhaps you're interested in weeds, for example, and you know that that's something that you need to get out there and create some maps, and you think that drones are gonna be the answer for this. Or perhaps you're at a school and you've already been flying the micro drones for a little while in the classroom, and you're ready to take the next step. If you said yes to one of those questions, then our drone mapping course is exactly for you. So this is all about how you can use small drones in the sub two kilo range that have a decent camera on them to capture aerial photos for the purpose of mapping. So this is not a course about learning how to fly, it's how to capture data and how to capture it properly so that when we get it out the other end, the information that we get is going to be of value. So this course goes through four main modules. So the first part is all about understanding how we plan our missions so that we can capture the best data possible. Then we move on to actually pre-processing that data. So extracting an ortho mosaic and a digital surface model out of that data. From there, we also look at when and where to conduct field survey and how you might go about doing that. And then finally, we bring it all together, the field survey, the image data capture, and all your knowledge that you've gained so far to create a map. And we do this through using geographical information systems. So we start to analyze that data and we start to create an information output product. So if you're really ready to take that next step and you want to start producing information, not just pretty pictures, come on in and I hope to see you in the course and I look forward to seeing your data capture and the maps that you can create out of it too.